Hi, I'm Jordan Long, and today we're going to talk about this one thing that, al that always happens. Oh, it's nothing bad that happens. So, let me just get into a little bit of what's going on before I get into what I'm talking about. So, in wrestling, you're going to have sides. There's always been sides. There's always been those who liked one wrestling business over the other. For many years, it was WCW and ECW. And when those two shut down, there were many other ones. They were short-lived, but they were out there. And then, of course, and then you had IW, and then you had AEW. And some folks believe that IW and AEW is the winning side. That they are the ones that are going to outlive WWE. Which is their belief, their thought. They have no truth to it, but that's what they believe. Why they believe this, who knows why they believe it. But, they believe it. It doesn't mean how many wrestling businesses came and gone. It doesn't need how many wrestling businesses WWE outlived. In their mind, they believe that IW and AEW are bringing WWE down. Even though there is no truth to this, IW's been around for 17 years, soon to be 18 years. AEW's may only been around for maybe four months. But in their head, they believe that these two are going to bring down WWE. Why? Because I guess in their head they hate WWE and they want to get even for what happened to WCW and ECW. Yeah, get even for something that happened uh, a long time ago. But anyway, that's not the grounds of the film. So, when you're on YouTube, you're gonna, there are many ways that one can behave. And, you know, my haters out there, they don't like when you lock them. Now, let's keep in mind, haters are folks who hate, f f hate anything. They're haters because they hate stuff. And it's not like, oh, it's not like they come, they're going to make it where they come on and say, oh, well, you lock me because I don't, because I don't stand with your work. No. I locked you because you said shit about me. That you made fun of me. Or you put me down or something. Or you made fun of someone else or put them down. You know, it wasn't, oh, we had a too unlike thought. Yeah. My haters would always say stuff like, oh, get a job, stop playing with dolls. Or they'd make fun of you. And they don't, and they think they're, and they think that, oh, how am I supposed to come back that? How am I have to talk have a talk with that? You know? They go they're like this, you know. But yeah. I don't deal with haters. Okay? Yes, if someone is being kind and they tell me they don't like my film, I'm okay, I'm good with that. But what I'm not good at, or I will not put up with, is that when someone's making fun of me, putting me down, making fun of someone else and putting someone else down on my films, or on my fairway, then yes, I locked them. Does that make me a weakling? No. It does not make me a weakling, but everybody's going to have their belief either way. You know? So... That's not in the grounds of it. So I have Vivian, who is my behavior or mood or feelings teacher, whatever you want to call it. And she usually has me talk about things that are going on during my day. And that seems to be at least two of the things that are going on. It goes like this. So, Jordan, how is everything? Oh, everything's good. You know, I got irked in my... My near kin Phoenix got irked and mad at me for liking WWE over IW and AEW. So, how did you deal with that? Well, I didn't get irked and mad. I asked her 
why she was irked and mad at me. And she said, because I like WWE and instead of liking IWAEW. Well, it's a good thing for you, Jordan. You didn't get irked and mad over it. Yeah, I will admit, Jordan said, sometimes I get irked and mad about stuff. Okay? Maybe things I shouldn't be getting irked and mad over. You know, it's not like there's a book out there or something that you can read or look at that will tell you, here's what you can get irked at, here's what you can get mad at. You know? Um, there's not. Yeah, that did happen to me. My near kin Phoenix is irked at me, is mad at me for liking WWE instead of liking IW or AEW or whatever. You know? It is what it is. And so, well, also other things I did, Jordan says, we also went to see TakeOver. You know, the TakeOver that was in Portland, Oregon. You know, uh, one's irks. And I thought it was good. I had a good time there. So then my godmother, Zena, my god sister, Gabrielle, my god brother, Dylan, and so did Cameron. We all had a good time. Yeah, well, did you get irked and mad or anything there? No, I didn't get irked and mad anything there. But I was sad, the whole, I was kind of sad that my near kin Phoenix never called me or never sent me a word saying she was sad for being irked and mad at me for liking WWE instead of liking IW or AEW. Yeah, Jordan, that's kind of uh, sad. It is sad. Yeah, it is sad, Vivian. It is truly sad, you know. And then also, you know, yeah, I got hang-ups. I got flaws. I'm not flawless. So, yeah, that's what happened. And I want to say that after that, I want to say I was probably more grown up than, uh, than Phoenix was for being irked and mad at me for not liking IW or AEW and liking WWE, which is kind of dumb. You know? I mean, if you want to like IW and AEW, that, that's your own business. But I say being irked, but being mad at irked over someone who likes WWE, that's not good. Okay. You know? So, anyway, I just want to say that's all the time I got here. I could make the film go a lot longer, but I got other things I have to do. So, if my film doesn't go, you know, <clears throat> only like scenes to end at 7 instead of ending at whatever. And usually at the end when I'm done with Vivian, it'll usually be like this. Well, uh, Jordan, keep up. Uh, whoa, whoa. Well, Jordan, keep up at it. You know, we'll talk next week. And uh, you let me know how things are going. All right. I'll let you know how. Oh, my neck. I'll let you know how things are going, Vivian. Well, that's good to know, Jordan. It truly is good to know. So, yes, I do have a mood or feelings or whatever you want to call it, teacher or, I guess, I don't know, caretaker. I don't know what you the term you would say it because therapist is more like a French borrowed word or a Greek borrowed word or a Latin borrowed word. So what would the English word be? I guess. Healer, I don't know. That might not even be the right word for it. You know. So anyway, it is what it is. I'm Jordan Long, and I'll see you later.